I remember that. Mm-hmm. You understand? But hold on. I could set a rewind a little bit first. <laughs> yeah. Rewind a little bit. Back in a, in a career. Fling it around and one part. So. Oh, um, alkaline. No, yeah. you know, I English should talk at a station. You, know. you understand? I click to a station. I English should talk over here. You understand? So. <laughs> so. Right here, though. Right here. Such a clown, Regine. <laughs> right here, though. Um. Alkaline, yeah. alkaline. You were you were a pivotal. You played played a pivotal role mm-hmm. in Alkaline's career. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like you're you're Mutually. one of the persons where, yeah. where 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 one of the pillars. Them were really a whole, whole of success. You understand me? I say so. So what was what was it like working with Alkaline? Because all the bad people say them man are really too tech with everybody, you know. So True. what was it like working with, with it's him? Strange. I, I, it's always you know I, it, it's always a good feeling when mm-hmm. when people express express it that way. But for me, what was interesting about it was the fact that at where he was in his career mm-hmm. to choose me as a brand new producer at the mm-hmm. time yeah that for me was really what kind of cement the link because may i say it was 2016 and 2016 alkaline i don't think alkaline needed a producer in 2016. that True. is it yeah, yeah, True. that say. is it so for the it was intelligent of him still for reach out for new songs and yeah, stuff man. maybe him did a vision say oh him kind of outgrow certain mm-hmm. things at the time and mm-hmm. a new song would help him propel towards mm-hmm. the years to come mm-hmm. so that was where the chemistry kind of just formed mm-hmm. you know yeah me and him would, we, we've done a lot of work together and he's just he's that kind of that person about the music you yeah. know a lot of time you meet artists and for them, it's not about the creative process. So the question, right, wait, wait, may I ask a quick, you know me, me have to play devil's advocate. Oh my God, every time. No, every listen, Lomina, man, Lomina, Denik. My Satan best friend, Denik, right, Javi? Denik, <laughs> you see me? Just as I yeah. Me ask a question, then when the people them want to know, the okay. things that were kind of controversial. Mm-hmm. So the thing is this now, what's the relationship like with um, Vendetta and Javi now? Good. No good. It's always. Everything 100. What no problem. 50. No problem. To all right, then. We're all at Movado's birthday bash. Yeah. No, we never get an invitation still, but, but <laughs> me understand. Yeah. Me understand. Good. We well, always understand. are doing it. All right. Always are doing it. All right. Because a lot of persons think that you're out of the Vendetta camp here. Zane and mm-hmm. you yeah, do your own thing. Yeah, you do your own thing, but, yeah, but, but still. I feel like. I feel like but Jamie, w- were you ever a part of the Vendetta camp? A family for me, you know. It's yeah. not even oh, about okay. music because, let me tell you, with Alkaline personally, it was a moment in my career where, boy, words can't even express. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Because artists. It wasn't easy. If I forgot you that story, they were yeah. there every Friday. That's true, that. You know? So for me, for, for him give me the opportunity, and it was genuine opportunities. Yeah. Not a, and it's not a lot of times artists give that genuine chance to say, yo, mm-hmm. I'm going to make it work for mm-hmm. you. And the first time I meet him, he tell me, say, yo, I'm going to make your boss. And mm-hmm. I had no music at the time. Mm-hmm. The only thing that I had was the bugle, mm-hmm. don't give up. Mm-hmm. And that was the only reference he had. Right. For, for can envision, say, yo. That you take yeah, it. So yeah, you yeah. see the potential before even mm-hmm. the whole of the rest of the world could have really it's actually see it. beyond music when, when it afford from a place like that. Yeah. A family. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Get me say, because I can tell you a thousand stories where it go 15 different other ways. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Get me say? Yeah, because... And he be, probably says the same thing about you too. You know, you yeah. never know. Yeah. You know? Facts. So it, just, you know, as a producer, you gave him a, a, mm-hmm. a platform to be different and to try something new. Mm-hmm. With Alkaline being who he is and with the different... I know I really call them beef, but with a different little animosity, them will run with circle him and like other artists and them something that they don't really spill over upon you. Like, you never really get no. the energy. If, if you want a beat for the something, no, just get it done. Mm-hmm. Get it done. Mm, it, it, it's just music, you know? Yeah. Man, the time I pre no personal thing with nobody. I love All that. Right, so, so, him call so, me no, and say, Bill, I read him yeah. Yeah. for whatever the reason mm-hmm. it is. With a two second read him done. Yeah. I love yeah. that. No, no, so, if, if, let us say, like, as Fully book. I know I said I shouldn't do this, but I'm gonna do it. Oh dear um, God! Oh dear Jesus! If squash call and tell us if you believe it, you believe it. You believe it for squash. <laughs> We're foolish. This ask me. Me no, me no. Me just ask them. Foolish. This ask me. Me must be people out there who ask me. That's with you. Yeah, you can't allow Satan that. Oi, oi. Come on, God said. Hello, Lord. The man making talk. The man was. We're we're trying to get sound bites. We're trying to get sound bites. We're trying to get viral moments. The man Anyways. said something a while ago and he overspoke it. What kind of people you can't get, son? You have to do better than that. <laughs> That's God, God speaks through me. All okay? Right. okay. No, but here, last year, about a year ago, I made a prediction and the people in social media did hear up and people had come warn me and come come and come cuss me off and say, oh, me chat too much and me this and me that. When I, I said... Mean, that's true, but... I know some chat too much. Right? That's something true. But what I said was, 450 is like the new version of Dexter Dabs. Mm-hmm. 
like me I say are the woman them artists this mm-hmm. now. This are the new woman's the, the young the young girl them favorite artists. Mm-hmm. Like next up are between uh, for the woman them between twenty five and forty five, but four fifty are the hard shop for the, the, the little little young young uh, up and coming the, the school as the school girl them love him. The eighteen to nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty four up to t- love him. Like this are the man where the woman them really the, like if you know back you know Back in the days when Backstreet Boys used to have them post and the woman them have it mm-hmm. one them all, yeah. a 450 that now for the younger generation of female. And when I said this, I said he is the new version of Yeah, of, of and Dexter you are not wrong to say that. And when I say that, everybody cuss me and say, oh, me I diss him. Oh, that you tell when I try to compare me. We love compare people. But it's not really comparison in a music. Is is the, is the is what I saw. I saw. I don't know if, I, if this was purposefully done. The marketing scheme where it was heading towards the ladies and appealing to the females more. Or this other something does coincidentally happen? No, it can't be coincidence. I don't think yeah. anything is a coincidence. It, it could be coincidence because, um, for the for as I said, the creative process matters to me and my team mm-hmm. a lot. And a lot of times when you sit down, as the years go by in 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 the early stages of artist career, mm-hmm. you have to find ways to make them expand as a brand. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You know, mm-hmm. artists um tend to always get stuck in a lane where yeah, if you're boss from the song there. It's like that's where you, you are. cannot see anything else. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know, so we kinda just sit down and strategize and say, oh, if you want that rounded fan base, I mm-hmm. got the music. So you mm-hmm. might hear a soca song from him, you might hear some jazz music. I love you know, that. A lot of people yeah, don't know yeah. that you went to Edna. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of people don't know you went to Edna. That's the yeah. thing. So Edna Massive, my no no love for hear them thing. Yeah? So big ups to the Edna Manny College of Visual and Performing Arts. Yeah. Just want to get it right that time. They're very strict. Yeah. We'll you know right how that's you never ever we'll get, never it get it right. You never get it right. Any so we'll ways. Edna and done. So. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> about Javi? Like, Javi, what we, are you working on right now? Uh, I have new music. Uh, I was... A couple of days ago, I was working on an intense project. So nice. And I'll what are what are together? What are your maybe. goals for 2023? I mean, other than working with Denik, you know, what are your ex? <laughs> <laughs> one thing Denik, I go fling in herself in our party. Me like you know. Yeah, First of all, it's a long time me and Javi supposed to work together, but time just like has it. not happened yet. Like you. But I, I, thing, I believe in timing like and God. So, but anyways, yeah, no, yeah.